hey yo welcome back to my channel so i just got home and i was like you know what maybe i should do a diaper bag video and the reason for this is because one i love watching these kind of videos i love seeing like what creative things people come up with or they feel like they need in their bag and then two i'm just nosy and i want to see so i figured i would do a video we're home we're getting back from getting situated so i figured i'll show you what i feel like i need on a daily basis and even when we're out for a while, like whether we're going to a museum or something like that. And then another creative bag that I recently just found that I wanted to share with you, if you are in fact going anywhere that's in a stadium or maybe you're going to the pool and you wanted something a little lighter. So come on in, judgment free zone. Don't hate me because I might have overpacked. I probably did. I probably did. Let's just, let's just admit it. I probably did. Mm. All right, so before we get started, I just want to throw it out there too. This is not a collaboration or sponsored in any way. My backpack was gifted to me um, from some friends from work at my baby shower. I absolutely love this bag. And I also recently just purchased the other one that I'm gonna show you as well. Um, so yeah, just a heads up for that and let's get started. I'll show you what I hoard in my diaper bag. Just a reminder, I did in fact say that this is a judgment-free zone. So if you feel like I'm a hoarder, please do not tell me. I don't wanna know. All right, so first off, here's the bag. It's got two pockets on, um, or excuse me, a pocket on either side here that zip up. Here's how they look. I keep my sunglasses in this pocket. And then this one here in the front comes down it has zippers on either side and then it just comes down like this and it has other pockets here on the inside so this is where i tend to keep things that i need like right away so my lip gloss chapstick i've got a couple of coupons here my leanna michelle business cards um, i've got a cell phone charger in here oh a phone number to the billing department for my interns after having caleb because they was trying to charge me oh i should probably like edit that out don't look at that. And then I've got Tatum a pair of little sunglasses in here because he will be in the back seat hollering saying that the sun's in his eyes and he's going to want them. So this sits in the passenger seat with me, thank God. Um, and then in the back here, there's also a pocket. This is where I kind of keep my stuff too, like my little lady stuff in case we're out and I need that um, because it's a fairly big pocket and it also has the extra straps in here so it's got a face mask in it and then my lady stuff and then it also has these um, straps here that click on right here in order to attach it to your stroller if you can see that so it's got two straps but uh, when I'm not using them I tend to just keep them back here because um, it kind of becomes a lot so this here is worn, you can carry it as a backpack. So it comes down like this. You can wear it as a backpack or you can pull the strap up and just sling it over your shoulder or you can just carry it as an actual bag. So the choice is yours, whichever one you decide to do. There's another pocket here on the side, which is ten, tends to be where I keep my keys. Um, ooh, what's in there? I'm hoping that's my, yeah, so here's the, it's got a little strap in there where you can put your keys at, but you can also put them in the front too if you wanted to, if you're like me and you have more keys on there and it may be a little harder to get them all in, but let me show you the inside. So this is the inside of the bag here. She has tons of pockets, which I really like and I almost have a hard time even filling it up, but, um, so the inside here, obviously I keep my wallet and then it's got, it comes with a changing pad and then it also comes with this extra bag here, which is where I keep um, diapers. Let me show you here. So it's got diapers in it. It also has like butt paste and then I keep a little cloth in there too that I use to just like dry his little tuchus off when I change it. We got that. And then I've got, let me bring you over here some you can see okay so it unzips all the way down and then it also has i have a bottle in here i'm gonna take all this out because i want y'all to see how much i can fit in here i've got tylenol i also keep some spf just because especially if we're going to be outside i like to have that this is for when the children drive us crazy you're going to need that make sure you got that in your diaper bag 
And then I've got hand wipes because a lot of times when we take snacks, Tatum always wants to like wash his hands. And if we're somewhere where we just can't do that, these are very helpful. I've got Caleb's formula. And then I also keep some hand lotion for me, hand sanitizer. I also keep some baby powder. We don't use this too, too often, but if he has, if Caleb has a massive blowout and that thing is stinking, you best believe I'm gonna freshen him up a little bit because it smells terrible. <laughs> My God, I tell you what, them youngins will give you a run for your money. I also keep a few snacks here because hands down, every time we go somewhere, I know that my toddler Tatum is gonna tell me he's hungry, even if he just ate. So I always take him some snacks. Uh, what else do I have in here? Oh, I keep an extra passy for Caleb. Even though he doesn't really like them, I do keep it just in case he's extremely fussy and he's in the car. I keep a pack of tissues. I also have this little um, Johnson & Johnson's first aid kit. All of these, like the tissues, the hand sanitizer, the baby powder, you can get all of these at the dollar spot, whether it be Walmart or Target. But I really like to have tissues just because you just never know if one of the kids, is like Tatum has allergies, so I like to have them for that, or maybe we just need them. And then I keep the little first aid kit because it's got a couple of like Band-Aids in there, alcohol wipes, and like little patches. Just because you never know. You could go somewhere, he could fall, he could scrape his leg, he's crying, mama's crying, and it just helps. I feel comfortable having it. So I do have that. This again is from the dollar spot. I've got Tatum's chapstick because when he sees me use mine, he always wants one and he slobbers on mine. I'm just gonna be honest. So I keep his own in here, okay? I ain't stupid. And then I keep a roller ball that has lavender, peppermint, and frankincense in it. I've got my little perfume in case after running around them all day, I start to stink. And I've also got um, Caleb's gas drops and little syringe because um, he is at that age right now with him being a newborn that he gets the hiccups fairly often and then he gets upset because his tummy's hurting. So I always keep those on hand too. What else do I have in here? Oh, this right here is a pocket for, so you can actually put the diapers in here in this big pouch, but that's where I keep the first aid kit because I really like having this in here and just that way it buckles so you can stick it back into the back of the bag like this. And I like it because if we're out somewhere, instead of having to go all in here and like pull out wipes, pull out something else from the other pocket, I can just take this out of the car if we need to, if we're, or like, instead of taking the whole diaper bag, like if you've ever been to a museum or a park or something, um, I could typically just leave the diaper bag with Josh and then just pull this out and take it with me to the changing room. And then that way I don't have to take the whole diaper bag. So that's why I tend to keep the diapers and the butt paste, which we don't really have to use that fairly often, but I like to have it just in case, cause you never know with being out for a long period of time or being in the car, you might need it. Um, so that's why I keep it in that particular pouch. And then this is for your wipes. So it's got a zipper here that you can slide the wipes in and then a zipper here at the top for easy access so that you don't have to take the wipes out if you don't want to. Again, if I'm going in separately and don't want to take the whole bag, then I can just unzip it here, pull the wipes out and take them with me. So I really like that feature of the bag. Um, over here, it also has another pocket that unzips. All of this comes out as well, so you can take this out to wash it if anything were to get dirty or if you had a spill. But here I keep a birth cloth for Caleb. I keep a change of an outfit for him. And then right now Tatum is pretty much potty trained, but I do like to keep an extra pair of undies and shorts just in case we have an accident. And then I also keep these. These are like a grab and go pack that you can get from the dollar spot at Target. So if you are going out to eat, or if you're going to a friend's house or something and you're worried you're not gonna be able to entertain your oldest tot, these literally are a dollar and they come with crayons, stickers, a little coloring pad, and you can just pull them out to help entertain the kids if you're out somewhere where there's not much going on. So um, that's what I keep in there. The, it also comes, the diaper bag also comes with a wet bag. So I keep this as well. So if he does need to change his undies, then I can just put the wet undies in here and change them out really quickly. And I don't have to worry about like that whole situation because that in itself could be huge and a big problem if you're out somewhere and you don't have anywhere to put wet clothes. 
Um, so I like to keep that stuff there. This bag is also big enough to keep his tablet in. So I sometimes will put the tablet in the back if I need to. And then I'll just use another one of these random pockets because they have six down here in the center. So I can just keep his charger in there. And that way, if we're gonna be on the road for a while, like we will be here coming up soon, um, I can just have everything where I need it to be. And it's all in this bag. So this is what I really like about this particular bag. I will say as much as I love the bag and how much it will hold, she will get heavy. Um, but again, this is just more so if we're out somewhere and um, I really need, I feel like, everything. He has to make this cameo. I was telling them, like, how I feel like I'm excessive when it comes to packing a diaper bag if we're going somewhere. You know yeah, what I mean? It all comes in handy. Can you say that again on the camera? It all comes in handy. Wait, put your face on here. Oh, I, I feel like that was a moment that needs to be like documented. Come on. Handsome. It all comes in handy. <laughs> so it's like, again, this isn't like every day I carry this all the time. Plus, when the bag does tend to get heavy, a lot of times I'm taking all this stuff because we are going somewhere where I need it and I can clip it onto the stroller. So keep that in mind too. But I feel like there's nothing in here that I wouldn't use if we were out for a long period of time. So that's a bonus for me that I can have all these pockets and I'm carrying this diaper bag also for two kids. So keep that in mind and at two different ages. So I feel like it's very beneficial, but let me show you this one. This is the one that I was telling you about that's from Amazon that I just recently got. And I'm so impressed with it. I was a little worried about buying like a plastic bag but again, we got there, and I didn't realize that this was a thing. This was the first time we've ever really taken him to, like, a stadium. Um, so I didn't know much about, like, the whole clear bag thing. But it makes sense, and I can deal with it. So, um, and I even was going to take this recently um, to a party that we were going to go to um, because I could put, like, all his swim stuff in it. But anyway, uh, I want to show you this. I feel like we could even use this a lot, too, when we go to the beach because... That bag is nice, but it's a nice bag. Whereas this one, if I did want to pack it for the beach, then I could, and if it gets sand on it, I can literally rinse this bag off. I'm not worried about sand getting in it because I can shake it out. And I want to say I spent at most maybe $30 on the bag. I don't even think it was that much. It might've been like $24.99, mm -hmm. but I'll link it below if you're interested. And I'll also link the website below for the big bag if you're interested in that one as well. But um, in the front, it's got a front pocket here. It's got three insulated slots that you can use for, so one of this, two bottles, and then there's a little small pack here, which I'm not 100% sure what I'm gonna put in something that small, maybe like a cheese stick or something. I don't know, that's a little strange but it will fit two bottles in it. So I like that. So you can put the two bottles and you can even put something else here. And then over here, it's got a side zipper where I would probably put like my sunglasses or something along those lines. It's even got the clear pouch over here with the slot in it where you can put the tissues. And I will say too, like even though it's plastic, it's a very thick plastic doesn't smell like plastic though. I don't know. It seems like it's fairly good quality. So I'm really, I'm really happy with it, but you can put tissues over here so that you can just pull them easily out of the pocket, but it also does unzip so that you can um, put them in there. And that's if you want to use it for that. If not, you could use it for something else, but um, that's probably likely what I would use it for. It's also got a zipper here on the strap. So I'm assuming if you wanted to just put like a single key in there, or maybe if you wanted to put your chapstick in it, something that you just needed easily to be able to get to. I probably shove a chapstick in there. I ain't gonna lie to you. I probably put a chapstick in there. And then it's got adjustable straps here on the top, as well as a handle that you can just pick it up and grab it. Um, let me open this up. So then once we get in here, see a little swimmy diaper, um, it's got, little mesh pockets on the inside. So one on the right and one on the left. So you can either put like a water bottle or maybe again, that would be where you want to put your sunglasses or you could put snacks, anything like that. It also came with a changing pad, which I really liked. And then it has this um, pocket back here. It's so hard to see everything because it's clear, but like that's where the changing pad goes. So I would probably put like his, um, changing pad and like a change of clothes, diapers, wipes, and something like yesterday when I had it packed, 
The only thing I put in here was my wallet, my sunglasses, Tatum sunglasses. I put a beach towel in it, sunscreen, his swim stuff, and then a change of clothes and a few snacks. And it was perfect to like just take and not need everything. So I really, really like this. I'm hoping we, well, not we, I'm going to take Tatum to see Blippi in a few weeks. And I'm really excited about that. And I'm really excited to be able to use this bag. That way, if I need it, I can still take something. And I like the fact that it's a backpack that I can just throw it over my shoulder and I don't have to hold on to it. You know what I mean? So I really like the bag. I think it's gonna come in handy a lot. Again, whether we go to the pool, if I just wanna be able to put something on my shoulder and not carry a huge um, pool bag, I feel like this is gonna be perfect. Oh, it also has a, ooh, Jesus, stop it. It also has this clip in it. I didn't even see that. So you can put your keys on it and it unclips so you can detach it. Stop! And then you can clip it back in and just put your keys in it. Stop it. That is snazzy. So yes, that's pretty much what I have in my diaper bags. Um, pretty much all the time. I'd be lying if I said I didn't use a lot of that stuff. So that's mainly the reason why I carry it. But um, I really like them. I hope this has helped you if you're a new mom or going into being a new mom, or maybe you're even a mom already and you have kids that are different ages to at least give you an idea of how you could pack your diaper bag or different essentials and things that we use. If you have any suggestions on things that you use or may need when you're out and about, I would love to hear that in the comments below. Also, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Okay, bye.